Hello, Dominant Iron. I'm Kreutz. In today's Raid Shadow Legends video, I'm going to be pulling shards for the Bounty Deck of Fate. Uh, let's go ahead and look at the event. Uh, I've compared the rewards you get compared to like Summon Rush or Champion Chase. Uh, Champion Chase, there's much fewer rewards, um, but you know the the two Lego books. Um, is comparable to that the compared to a summon rushes that we've had recently the le two lego books and mythical tome have been in there uh, even an eternal um soul stone was in there but uh in lieu of that we've got 500 of these eternal coins 500 of immortal coins and a couple of other soul stone of the lower soul stones um with the speed glyphs in there as well and then all the gear um uh, I, th I thought that was uh, worthwhile to go ahead and pull shards, especially since I I've, I've got a decent amount. I can spread it around between uh, the three types. I'm not going to do primals. Um, waiting for, for 2x for that. And then also they increased the number of epic cards uh, as opposed to, the, I think that was the last one. They moved it down to like six or something. So um, not that the chances are very high that hit on on any of these but well the any either of the two higher ones but uh with the increased chance to make it uh, an excellent event other other than a a decent one uh and at least in my estimation so i've already pulled uh three ancients uh pull up the excel document here that i've got showing uh how many shards i have at the moment uh the points you can get for the uh, bounty deck of fate what i've decided to go ahead and use to get uh, to match i've i've deducted 2000 points that i've gotten from dungeon divers so far any other points i get from dungeon divers i'll probably take off a void or a sacred uh depending on how much i get um and so yeah uh, that zero out is just the, the amount of points I need minus what uh, pulling these shards gives me. And then I, I, I wanted to compare the points that the pulling these amount of shards would get me in a, a champion chase or a summon rush, and it is definitely uh, more more points, especially for uh, the champion chase. It's an increase of 3,000, and then for the summon rush, it was an increase of uh, 2,500. Um, but uh, it's not not too bad, and uh, at least these are in two X's instead of you know usually summon rush is uh, is during ten X's, not two X's. So not too bad. All, all said and done, and uh, let's go ahead. I've got the space to make up the difference. I was gonna pull seventy two ancients. I've already pulled three, so I'm gonna make up the difference now. Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. Well, I'll see you tomorrow for voids. All right, uh, time to pull the voids. I'm going for 12. So here we go. Got three hours, 43 left. Hopefully I can make it in that time. I made space for 12. All right, here we go. Uh, I'm two shards into uh, Mercy, so I'm not expecting anything. Starting off with an epic, it's pretty good. Yay! She is new, and I wanted her for Hydra. Let's go, because I I have to manual everything because my <laughs> gear sucks. It's not the best. Let's go! I'm happy about that. She's pretty cool. All right, so there's three, two epics. Not too shabby. I don't need any uh, voids for the Lady Mikage fusion. I've got all the rares. And I think I've got them all leveled up and ascended, ready to go to turn into Weregrin. And I have Weregrin. Do I have Weregrin? Now I do. Oh my gosh, speak of the devil. Uh, but I'm going to uh, <clears throat> definitely... Uh, make use of the champion chase points that are on offer with him uh, being available in that larger fusion for
for Lady Makage. So I was also looking uh, for all the shards I pulled yesterday. I forgot that I needed a, a wrist arm. I still don't have one. And I think that's that's two summoning sessions now where I have I failed to pull a wrist arm. And I remember I remember, you know, feeding him many times <laughs> because I, I like to uh oh, hey, he's new. Ostrox Bungle, what do you do? Whenever an enemy attempts to place it has a chance to reflect it. Okay. Removes a random debuff, places increased accuracy. Okay. Attacks all enemies. Three okay. Wait, what is happening? Oh, but it's just the difference between two or three turns for the block buffs. Interesting. And then has a 70% chance of transferring one random debuff. I don't know about all that. I don't know. I don't know if he'd be good for Hydra. Or I, I don't know. Maybe he could have some use in Hydra, but... Nothing, nothing on the level of a like an Ugo or a Skrank. Man, I'm getting a ton of Evics. Too bad it's not a champion chase. Oh, there it is. All right, cool. Uh, I'll see you tomorrow for Sacreds. All right, let's go ahead and finish off with twelve Sacreds. I'm only two into Mercy, so not expecting anything. It'll be lucky if, if I get something. Really, a, one of the epics I don't have. <gasps> That's my first Vogoth! Yes! Oh, I've wanted him for a while. Let's go. I'll take that. Let's go. There's not there's not, not many epics left in the game that I don't have, but uh, at least uh, non-void. And he was one of them. Fantastic. Oh, that makes me happy. Franox. No, it's Aishma. Aishma's the one that's in the Lady Makage. I think that, uh, I'll go, I'm going down to 36. I started with 48, so I'm going to 36. So halfway through. I was so excited to pull Hofuris for the first time, and then uh, they came out with Uko like, <laughs> right after. <gasps> Let us go! That is my first Kaimar! Oh! Oh, that is so good! Oh! Let's go! My first champion to actually reset the cooldowns. Like, just straight up resets them i've got i've got lots of uh decrease he is my first mm, let's go so, so that took eight so that was ten and ten ten shards in let's go 2x coming coming good all right uh so let's make a newt uh or just reset the mercy oh, I'm so glad I decided to go for the Bounty Deck of Faith. I, I saw the, a lot of mixed reactions on whether this was uh, good or not. This is should be the last one. But uh, hey, it got me a Kymar, so <laughs> I'll take it. That is phenomenal. Wait, am I not done? Oh, oh, no, no, I've got two more. That's right, that's ten. Oh, so good. <laughs> Got a Vogoth and a Kaimar. All right, no. Man, I just cannot... I cannot get these five champions right here. Delaja, Ilfrig, Eshma, Enda, and uh, Firgun. Or Firegun, however you pronounce it. But no rush. I'll get her eventually. Um, and when I do... I. Like, I've got I've already got four books. I feel like I'll I'll be able to book her. Uh, they've got a two X for primals tomorrow, but uh, 
and it will concur with a champion chase, but since I've only got 22, I'm not, I'm not going to pull for that one. Uh, all right, what did I want to do? I wanted to, yeah, let's go through the index first, let's see all the new champions I got. So, uh, yeah, I didn't realize this at the time, but Warcaster is new. Um, not super impactful for me because I've got block damage for with other champions for clan boss. Oh, Talia was my first is my first copy of her. Oh, well there you go, very cool. I gotta remember not to. Who is new here? Oh, <laughs> let's go. All right. Phenomenal, just phenomenal. Ostrux and uh, oh, Bogoth. Let's go. And then let's see. Franox is new. Really? Oh, was she not part of a fusion or some of that? I guess not. And then lastly, why Drydnia? This has been a a pretty good go. The the ancients were nothing, like much at all but uh yeah i'm happy with uh, my white dry Nia, my vogoth and my prince kaimar for sure let's go <laughs> all right uh and then uh yeah there we go i've got forty thousand ready to pull all these and hopefully get some in a row let's go three in a row what we get oh let's go i'll take the See the gems, it's the gem. I want to, uh, I like the gems, the soul stones, and the energy. Uh, I don't care about these six things and I don't care about the feast. Those would be the dream of dreams. The eternal actually would, the soul stone would also be the dream of dreams, but. Oh, of course not. Ooh. Oh. Oh. oh, of course. All right, so we've got four, so there's six left of the top tier. There we go, we've got another three in a row. Five star chicken. I don't think I've ever used a a five-star chicken. Oh, here we go. And another book. Well, I, I have no need for epic books. Uh, they're all over my account. Oh, dang it. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Only four left. Oh, of course. Dang it. So only three left. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Let's see here. Uh, oh, man. Where was it? It was right there. Bummer sauce. All right. Well, cool. Uh, yeah. There, there it is. I've got what I ended up with. Three. Uh, one of the blue and two of the greens. Pretty good. All right. Well. That's the end of the video. Thank you for watching to the end. Consider doing all the YouTube things and have a great day. Cheers. The video is over. This is the end screen. You can go now. Bye.